This video will show you how to use the library search box. Here is the library website, and on it, you can find the library search box. Type your keywords into the library search box. I'm going to use climate change, and then click on search. And here is the results page. On the left, you can use the facets to further refine your search. Here are some of the most used options. Full text online. Restrict the results to view online resources only. Peer reviewed and scholarly articles for good academic content. Available in the library. Restrict the results to only a few physical items available in our libraries. Publication date to view results from within a particular date range. Content type. Restrict to particular types of content, including journal articles, newspaper articles, books, book chapters, audiovisual, and more. Subject. To further refine your search with related terms. Journal title. Author. Creator, Collection, Databases Providing Access to the Articles. Let's look at the first book. This is available online. Let's click on the title. Under View Online, you can see which databases this item is available from as an ebook. And here's the book. Please be aware that due to database licensing, some ebooks may have a limit on the number of concurrent users or may have download restrictions. If you are off campus, you may need your Western account to access materials online. Let's go back and close this record. Let's scroll further down. Now let's look at this item. Click on the title. Under locations, you can see which libraries hold physical copies of the book. Let's close this record. And let's look at some articles. We're going to scroll down. Here is an article. It's available online. You can click on Available Online to access the article or click on the title. Scroll down and under View Online, you can see which databases this article is available from. Click on a link to access the journal article from either of these databases. Please take note of the full text availabilities of each database. For more information, please contact the library.